to talk about this time is HTML code. We've been doing pictures a variety of different ways, but this time we want to articulate more information via text. Let's take a look. What I'm going to do is zoom in to my Brazilian Jiu Jitsu location right here. And I might want to add more context to this location. So what I'm going to do, right click properties, and I might want to type stuff here in this description box. I might put CTA, which stands for Kyoterra Academy. They do BJJ and MMA. Maybe put something in here like a adult classes, kids classes, gi and no gi. Something like that. Let's take a look at how this looks. When I click OK, now I can click on this hyperlink right here where it says Kyoterra Academy in blue and that will bring up what I just typed into that description box. But I might not like the way that looks. If you want to edit this, we have to talk about HTML code. HTML code is very similar to what you see on web pages on the internet. We're just going to touch the basics here. Let's take a look at an example. Take a look at this. I've got a folder. There's nothing in it. All it is is HTML code. And when I click on that, it brings this up. And let's take a look. It says this is, text is regular. This text is bold. This text is in italics, so on and so forth. Now, when I right click properties, this is the code that made this happen. So let's take a real close look. You see the BRs in the uh, less than and greater than? That is the break. That's going to be the spaces in between. And here where it says this text is bold, the less than, B greater than means begin the bold code. And then at the end, I've got the same thing just with a slash in front of the B. That means end the bold code. And then same thing for italics, center, so on and so forth. So what I've done is if I scroll down here, you'll see this combination of HTML code which created this good brief template, bullet item one and bullet item two and three and so on. So what I'm going to do is copy this. Take all of this. I'm going to copy it. Now what I'm going to do is come to my Kyoterra Academy and paste it. Hit enter a few times here. And paste it. Now what I'm going to do is keep the code, but change the words in between. So I'm going to cut that change it from good brief template to that. Maybe bullet item one is now going to be adult classes. Kids classes is now going to be bullet item number two. And then gi and no gi is going to be bullet item three. Click OK when I'm done. And now when I click on this, I have used the HTML code from my examples. So what you can do, if you want, you can email me and I will send you my HTML uh, code examples so that you can use it for yourself or you can go online and find many resources where you can use HTML code as well. Thanks for watching, map your world.